Hello, Pat Talk community, and happy Thursday. You are watching the In Touch Weekly Show, and I'm your host, Dorothy Cassisari, the senior editor for In Touch Weekly. Happy New Year! I saved this from my New Year celebrations because I wanted to wish all of you a great, great, happy New Year, happy 2012. It's so crazy that it's a brand new year. I'm, I'm still writing 2011 next to just about every date. I mean, I do this every January. I'm sure many other people do. But I'm trying to ingrain it in my head that it's 2012 now. <laughs> Toller Tassimau, Happy New Year. I need a woman in my life. <laughs> uh, Dorothy, I love you. Are you a Christian, sis? <laughs> all right, well, lots of questions, lots of comments. I love all of it. Um, so I would love to hear how everybody spent their New Year's. I had said last week that I was having a big party at my apartment. Well, sorry, not a big party. We were having maybe 20 people. Uh, I like kind of a low-key New Year's. Maybe that's not low-key to some people, but uh, I used to do the clubs. I used to do the, you know, $300 tickets that I couldn't afford. I used to do the two-hour coat line just to get my coat at the end of the night. And I uh, decided that I wasn't going to go that route anymore. So I had about 25 people to my apartment here in New York, and I played Betty Crocker. I cooked and I baked for about two days leading up to it. And let me just tell you, I'm not a baker, I'm not a cook, but somehow I pulled together the most amazing spread of food. And I'm only saying that because I'm so in awe of myself because I can't cook. I'm the black sheep of my Italian family. Um, but we had a great spread. We had. Um, buffalo chicken mac and cheese, which was a huge hit. I had a big, huge six-quart pot of pumpkin uh, beef chili, which was huge. I baked chocolate caramel cookies and Nutella cupcakes and Bailey's chocolate chip bread pudding. And I, I'm talking about it like I'm talking about somebody else because if you know me, you know that there's no way I can pull this off. But I did. So anyway, um, I would love to hear <laughs> Jen Karma. Whoop, Dorothy. Hi, Jen. How are you? Um, I really do want everybody to try and, you know, raise your hands. I like to hear your voices. You're hearing my voice. You're going to get tired of hearing it after a while. Um, so I need to hear yours. But anyway, let's talk a little bit about, um, oh, everyone's saying so many things. New Market, Happy New Year, my dear. Uh, Honorable82, hello, Dorothy. Hello, Honorable82. I shouldn't read your comments because I'm just encouraging you to write something on the board, but... I really, really would like to hear your voices. So, um, sweet and sour, welcome. You're new in here, welcome. Every Thursday we're here, 2.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to 3 o'clock. We talk about the latest in celebrity gossip and news. And of course, you know, I tell you all about my uh, Rachel Ray attempts as well as a baker and as a chef. Um, but anyway, <laughs> Vival, I can't pronounce this, but Happy New Year Cupcake. I've never been called Cupcake before, so I appreciate that. And I made Nutella cupcakes for New Year's, so how fitting. Anyway, let's move on to um, my my other co-host, the new issue of In Touch Weekly. I really want to get to a few stories that have been going on this week that I'm dying to share with you. Before I talk about what's in the magazine, I want to talk about Mariah Carey and Nick Cannon. I uh, was on Headline News yesterday talking about Nick Cannon, and I don't know if anybody saw, but he was laid up in a hospital bed in Colorado with acute kidney failure. I'm not sure if anyone saw the tweet pic that Mariah Carey shared with everyone, but she's just cuddled up with her man in her flannel pants. She has a, she's feeding him through a straw and it's just, it's really actually a very cute photo. But I just, you know, I wonder with this, with the news uh, cycle changing so much, you know, the fact that celebrities are now kind of breaking their own news on things. Everybody found out about this through Mariah Carey's tweet. Um, so I'm wondering if anybody out there, you know, saw this story and, you know, we're wishing Nick Cannon, uh, you know, good wishes because nobody likes to be in the hospital, that's for sure. He's back in L.A. now, in a hospital in L.A., and he's doing a lot better. So I just wanted to mention that. Um, okay, let's see what we have going on here. Sabrina's, Sabrina's Palisade. Martha Stewart is making way for Rachel Ray by leaving the cooking scene. Yes, yes, she is. I, I don't know. Martha Stewart, Rachel Ray, it's kind of a toss-up for which one I like better or possibly which one I find to be more annoying. Um, I only say that because Rachel Ray, God love her, I do her 30 minute meals in my kitchen all the time. It takes me about an hour to do what she does in 30 minutes, but I really do love her, but she's, she's a little irritating, it, just for me personally, I don't know. Something about her, um, 
I, something, I don't know, something. But anybody could say that about me, too. So, I, you know, I don't know. I'm not going to pass judgment here. Just my personal opinion. Uh, Martha Stewart, I, I really like. Now, I've heard a lot of stories about her where she's really icy and she's kind of an ice queen. She's not super nice to people. But uh, but I do like her recipes, too, although they're a little bit more complicated complicated than Rachel Ray's. Um, Fat Albert's Big Sister. I love, sorry, I love that name. It's so funny. Said dialysis is a bummer. Talking about Nick Cannon, you know, if the kidney failure is bad enough, he will have to go on dialysis, but it hasn't been determined yet. Uh, you know, I'm not a doctor, but I did all this research yesterday as to what exactly acute kidney failure means, and hopefully the damage is reversible and it hasn't gotten so bad that he's going to have to go through dialysis, because that's really, really tough. Follow me on Twitter, at Dorothy Lauren. Follow In Touch Weekly, at In Touch Weekly, and also check out my Facebook page, and let's talk more on there. It's facebook.com backslash Dorothy TV page. It's a public page, so anybody can view it, and uh, there's lots of fun pictures and celebrity news and gossip, and uh, I'm so glad that you guys tuned in, and a happy new year. I'll see you next Thursday. Bye.